If you've used Google Docs or Google Sheets or Google Slides very much at all, you've probably experienced the time whenever you gave or shared a document with someone and you said, now this is my template, so make sure that you make a copy of this before you type on it. And the way that you make a copy is to go to File and then you click Make a Copy. So then it just copies this and it belongs to that person's drive from then on. But that is putting the responsibility in someone else's hands. There's a way that you can force people to make a copy just by using your document. And so it's very, very easy. The first thing I want to do is check my sharing settings of this document. I'm going to go to Share. And then right here it says anyone with the link can view. I'm going to change that to anyone with the link can edit. Okay, now if I am down here on my, on my link, you can see right here at the very end it says edit. It has this backslash and then it says edit. So that should be the same if I click up here and look at this URL. What I want to do is get rid of this word edit and replace it with the word copy. Okay, so now I'm going to highlight this. I just copied it on my clipboard. Now let's test this out. I'm going to paste that into my Omnibar. Hit enter. And here it is, it says, would you like to make a copy of this document? So I have just forced anyone with that link that I have given them to make a copy. So right here, if I say make a copy, now notice the name has changed to copy of, which is the exact same thing that I had before. So these two documents here are different. This one just says knowledge question research. This one says copy of knowledge question research and all I did was change the word here at the end from edit to copy. That easy.